Hey guys, um, today we're going to talk about something rough that happens today, and it's mostly going to be my dog, my dad, um, speaking, because I, don't, I really don't know how to talk very well, so, yeah. Oh, so we, uh, Charlene got her first scare of a near car wreck today, and uh, we were just driving on the regular road, and then somebody merged into our lane unexpectedly, and we had to swerve out of the way to avoid an accident. And uh, shook her up. It shook up me and her mom too because uh, she didn't even say sorry. Yeah, we. She went into a parking lot and then like we went to go acknowledge her because we were pretty upset about it. I mean, we didn't fight or anything, but yeah, you know, like we saw her walking into a store and then there was no sorry. So. It's pretty sad, pretty scary for you, right? Mm, I actually cried. Wow. Yep. I mean, no one got hurt, and things happened. It was an accident. I mean, it was really a mistake that the other driver made, you know. So luckily for us, we were alert and focused. And, and we and, survived. Yeah, like luckily we were aware enough to avoid an accident, but it was pretty scary nonetheless. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> technically, I'll show you how, I'll tell you how my reactions felt on my side, so. How it went for me was like, yeah, we were just having a normal day, got, going away from my, um, just jiu jitsu. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, going away from jiu jitsu, like, and we were just having, we were talk, talking, having fun, car, going home. And unexpectedly, um, me, uh, my dad started honking. I didn't know why. I looked up. A car was like right in front of us, less than two inches. That's what I think. And so much bumping. Yeah, so the lane we merged into was supposed to be like a left turn only to go left into another shopping center. But then it was one of those left turn lanes where there's a curb, like a little divider to separate the left turn lane from the regular lane. And we jumped that curb. So Charlene thought we were in the grass. <gasps> but that's and also good thing everybody was wearing their seatbelt, right? Because if you there was no seatbelt, then could have gone flying. Yeah, just like all that stuff, all the stuff in the car, we heard it like fall onto the floor mat. But luckily for us, we were wearing seatbelts, and so we were safe. I was still just chilling in my chair, but then once I heard it, I got so scared. <laughs> my heart started beating so fast. I went on the armrest and then I just went in this position right here and started crying. And my dad was like also in a bad mood, so I was like, Daddy, that was so scary. And then he said, that, yes it was, like in a, in a very like, bad mood, so. Yeah. Yeah, there was nothing fun we about it. We, we hope that. Uh, I doubt that this is not going to happen again, but I hope it's not going to happen again. Well, we just have to be ready for it and then... Um, that way we can prevent an accident, right? Because mm -hmm. sometimes we can't prevent mistakes, but we can try to be aware of them to avoid accidents. Mm -hmm. Right? <laughs> and if we weren't wearing our seatbelts, then yeah, like my dad said, we could have went flying, big thing would have happened, police, the whole paramedic stuff would come. And some bad stuff will happen, and I never want to go in the ambulance, but... That's why whenever we see an ambulance, or... A... We always say, I hope everybody's okay, because we never know if that's one day going to happen to us. Mm -hmm. So, thank you for watching, and see you guys next time in the next video.